morning rush hour in Columbus, Ohio. Making my way down the highway, jockeying for position like it's the Indianapolis 500. As I'm racing along here with thousands of other people who are also going to their jobs, put in their time, eager to get there and just as eager to leave, makes me wonder. It's kind of a metaphor for the way we live today. We're in competition with each other on so many levels. We compete for jobs. We compete for space. We compete for relationships. Now, there's nothing wrong with competition. It's nature's way. Animals in the wild, they compete with each other. Strong survive. Get to pass along their genes. I wonder if that's a model for the human race, though. I wonder if that's a, a way for us to live. We go to school, right from the start we're taught that, you know, we're in competition with one another. Grades, grades are good grades are rewarded, bad grades are punished. You get to advance to the top of the class, on a roll. You get really good grades and try hard, you're gonna maybe get into a good college. You gotta get funding though, because it's not cheap. But you work your way through college, come out with your diploma, your degree, certificate in hand. You want to go get that job, the one you've been working for. There's an opening. You go in, you put on your suit, polish up your resume, go in. And there's one job for 200 people competition. If you don't get that job, well, you know, keep looking. Maybe another one will open up. In the meantime, maybe you'll go do something that you weren't planning on. Sell clothes in a clothing store. Books in a bookstore. Make sandwiches in a sub shop. Nothing wrong with that. It's good honest work. Not quite what you had in mind, though, is it? Not quite what we were sold. But that's life. Maybe you're not driving the latest car. Kind of limping along. Like I am. <laughs> I found myself in a lot of different jobs. Mainly because I didn't really have a plan when I was 15, 16, 17 years old about what I wanted to do. Unless, of course, there was an, some kind of a career track for someone who wanted to be a holy man. It doesn't seem to be a career option in this country. Nope, you've got to work for somebody or start a business. Either one of those is a pretty iffy proposition nowadays. Our parents, in a little bit of a different time, you could rely on being the company if you were a good worker for maybe your whole working life. Now it's all about competition. There's plenty of people out there who want to take your place. So shape up. Do more with less. Take on more responsibilities. Take your work home with you. It's no wonder we're the most stressed nation in the world. It's no wonder we have this vague feeling, a lot of us, that life is unsatisfying. In competition, it's good for animals, but we're not, we're not just animals. There's a place for compassion. There's a place for cooperation. And 
sometimes it finds its way even onto this busy freeway and into our busy lives. I'm not saying this to solve any problems. I'm just saying it to kind of give a touch point of where we're at, where I'm at. 